Okay, so we're here at Tensuke Market and this is in Arlington Heights and they have a cutting of a bluefin tuna today. Yeah, it's gonna be exciting because it's a massively big yes. fish. And we didn't get to experience this in Japan when we went to Skiji Market. And actually, this week, yeah. Skiji Market closed down after 83 years. Well, they're it, gonna relocate. Yeah, it's not that they're closing down, they're just closing down temporarily because yes. they're relocating. So, but anyways, this sounds pretty cool. Yeah, way, I'm excited. All right, let's do this. They don't have spam musubi, I'm sorry, babe. <laughs> Nothing that I wanted. They don't have deco either. They can get trim. I'll get one, it's warm. crazy there were a ton of people guys so yeah we, we didn't expect there to be so many people and it was really crowded so it was really hard to get a good look at it i mean we got some so it'll be really cool to see and uh people were really excited about it and they gave us a little bit of history and uh they were selling off like the chunks that they were cutting off they were selling off right then and there which was also very cool yeah. now it's time to have breakfast yeah <laughs> so what did you get uh, I got the onigiri uh, barbecue beef. Uh, you got lucky because they are, they always sell out. Yeah, they always sell out, but they were um, restocking right before we left, so I grabbed some. Uh, and you always forget how I, to do I, this. Yeah, I always forget <laughs> how to do this. Oh man. No, but it's fine. You're you're fine. Just don't. <laughs> yeah, I think it's like this, and then you unwrap it over here. Yeah, you gotta be more gentle. Oh man, I'm making a mess. And same thing on this side. Do it from the bottom. I yeah. Was oh boy. 30 minutes later. Yeah, I totally ruined that. But yeah, it's supposed to end up something like this. So I'm gonna take a bite. Hmm. All right. All right. Let's see how much better my wife does opening this. Yes. I got tuna instead of beef. I love tuna mayo. This must stick into the... So good. Tastes like a Japanese morning. Mm. All right, so where to now? Um, so I, I don't think we're gonna wait for those people to get their tuna. So probably go to Mitsuwa for lunch. Yeah, That's I guess good. That good. All right, let's go. All right, so crash the 
lady I've gone on my tour because it's also pretty full. Uh, I think we're gonna have. We did go there too. <laughs> yeah, but we're not gonna eat there. So we're just gonna have our second snack and then try to find a ramen place in Evanston. Yeah. And this is something. This is something you've been missing since Japan. Yeah. Like katsu sando. I mean, the one that we had in Japan was way thicker than this, but let's see if it's just as soft. So I'm gonna get. I'm gonna have a bite. Itadakimasu. Hmm. It's good. It's not as soft as the one in, in in Japan because the one in Japan, it was like biting into a marshmallow. This one has a little bit more. I don't want to say tough, but you know, um, a little more bite into it. Yeah, you got to put a little bit more fork into your bite, though. But it's, it's it's still good, very good. All right, I'll be the judge of this. Mm. That's bulldog sauce. Ah, that's what mm. it was. I just don't. All right, right. That's a little bite, but really good. The flavor is right, so.